The last few years have been undeniably challenging. The best way to face challenges? Together. Paul's message to the Galatians still rings true today. As Christ's church, we lend each other strength, share each other's burdens, and offer stability and security. This speaks to the mission of Portico Benefit Services and those who walk that mission every day. As the ELCA's benefit provider, our ministry is to support your ministry. As a parent with young children, the pandemic has been beyond tough. But through all the juggling of work and kids, it's helped to know that my work is lending stability to people's lives. Whether it's a checkup, a chronic condition, or a medical crisis, I picture our members in need and take comfort knowing that the health benefits and resources my team so carefully selected are making a positive difference. My family has a strong Lutheran heritage. My great-grandfather, grandfather, and father were all Lutheran pastors. While that's not my vocation, I view my work at Portico as a calling to provide financial wellness to those who serve. Growing up a pastor's son, I know it's difficult to lead a congregation in normal times, let alone during a pandemic. Knowing all that our leaders do, my team and I strive to achieve competitive investment performance so pastors and church workers can focus on their ministry needs, confident about their financial future. So much is changing about how we show up for each other. Our conversations take place on screens. Generational and regional differences make it hard to understand each other. Yet I see hope. At Portico, we're working to recognize and respect differences. The team I manage works with many social ministry organizations who often rely on first and second generation immigrants to serve in critical caregiving roles. They might not have had benefits before. They might not understand the value benefits bring. English may be their second language. We recognize that the old way of doing things doesn't always work and we're taking time to handhold, meeting them where they're at. Right now, we all need to find ways to replenish ourselves, to refill our cups so we can bring new energy to serving in this changing world. As an EOCA deacon and the portico representative serving this synod, this is a calling for me. But as you've seen, I don't do it alone. Everyone at Portico, from those you know to people working behind the scenes, is striving to lighten the load for your congregations and the people serving them. Thank you for partnering with Portico. And remember, we're here to help.